So here uh, we're looking at some live x-ray images for a patient who had a test called a discography. Uh, this is a, a test that's really meant to help us understand if somebody's having a lot of back pain, can we understand if the discs and damage to the discs uh, is responsible? And if somebody has multiple discs that look like they're in question, uh, it can help us to understand is it all the discs or which discs may be causing which symptoms? And so uh, with some IV sedation to keep the patient um, comfortable, we actually numb up the skin and put needles into the discs that are in question. And what we're doing is actually injecting some dye into the disc. Now, a normal disc, when you inject the dye, it blows up right in the center of the disc, this teeny little needle, um, just like blowing up a water balloon. And, and so what will happen is we'll see the dye build up right in the center of the disc. And actually, as we test that, the patient feels nothing. And so that's a normal disc. So this is a way to verify, oh, this is a good disc. It's not hurting someone. Uh, now, uh, a disc that has degeneration, that may mean that the inner structure of the disc is cracked and torn. The proteins are worn away. In some situations, the outer lining of the disc is completely ripped. And so in a disc like that, when we inject the dye, we may see the dye expand more, it'll hold more dye, or we may even see the dye leak out through the cracks and tears in the disc. And so here's an example of a disc that does have some more degeneration. And we can see as soon as we inject dye into that disc, we see it extending all the way from the front to the back of the disc. And so we see that disc is degenerated. We learn how much volume it holds of, uh, compared to a normal disc. And more importantly, as soon as we test that disc, the patient feels their typical pain. And so it's a good way to learn something based on the picture, but also understand what pain they're having.